Tell me about hash bars. What so you want to know? Well, hash is legal there, right? Yeah, it's legal, but it's not a hundred percent legal. I mean, you can't walk into a restaurant, roll a joint, and start buffing away. You're only supposed to smoke at your home or certain designated places. Those are hash bars. Yeah, it's break down like this. It's legal to buy it. It's legal to own it. It's legal to sell it if you're the proprietor of the hash bar. It's legal to carry it, which really doesn't matter, because get a load of this. If the cop stops you, it's illegal to search you for this. Searching you is the right that cops in Amsterdam don't have. That did it, man. I'm fucking going. And that's all there is to it. You'll dig it the most, but you know what the funniest thing about Europe is? What? It's the little differences. A lot of same shit we got here, they got there. But there, they're a little different. Examples? Well, in Amsterdam, you can buy beer at movie theater. And I don't mean in a paper cup either. They will give you a glass of beer, like in a bar. At Paris, you can buy beer at McDonald's. But you know what they call quarter pounder with cheese in Paris? Now they don't just call it a quarter pounder with cheese? No, they got the metric system there. They don't know what the fuck a quarter pounder is. So what did they call it? Royale with cheese. Royale with cheese. What did they call a Big Mac? Big Mac is Big Mac, but they call it Lee Big Mac. Lee Big Mac? What did they call a Whopper? I don't know. I don't go into Burger King. But you know what they put on french fries in Holland instead of ketchup? What? Menace. God damn! I've seen them doing it, and I don't mean a little bit on the side of the plate. They fucking down them in it! <coughs> we should have fucking shotguns for this kind of deal. How many are there? About three or four. Counting our guy? I'm not sure. So we could have five guys up there. It's possible. We should have fucking shot against her. What's her name? Mia. How did Marcelas and I met? Oh no, however people meet people. She used to be an actress. She ever do anything I would saw? I think her biggest deal was she starred in a pilot. What's a pilot? The show is on television? I don't watch TV. Yes, you are aware that there's an invention called television, and on that invention, they show shows. Yeah? Well, the way they pick a show is they make one show, and that show is called the pilot. Then they show that show to the people who pick the shows, and based on the strength of that one show, they decide if they want to make more shows. Hmm. Some get picked up, and they become television programs, and some don't, and become nothing. She starred in the one that became nothing. Hmm. You remember Antoine Rockamore, half black, half Samoan? We used to call him Tony Rocky Horror. I think who you mean. What about him? Marcellus fucked his ass up real good. And, and word on the street is it was on account of Marcellus Wallace's wife. <laughs> what did he do? Fuck her? No, 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 no. Nothing bad like that. Well, what then? He gave his wife a foot massage. A foot massage? That's all? What did Marcellus do? Sent a few guys over to his place. He took Antoine out to the patio of his apartment and tossed his ass right over the balcony. Antoine fell four stories, and since then he's developed a speech impediment. That's a damn shame. But still, I have to say, play with matches, you get burned. What do you mean? You don't make him in Marcel as well as new bridal foot massage. It was a foot massage. It's nothing. I give my mother a foot massage. It's like laying hand on Marcellus Wallace's new bride in a familiar way. Is it as bad as eating her out? No, but you're in the same fucking ballpark. Huh? Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop right there. Eating a bitch out and giving her a foot massage ain't even the same fucking thing. Not the same thing. Same ballpark. No, it's not even the same ballpark. Listen, man. Maybe your massage method differs from mine, but when you're eating a bitch out and sticking your tongue in her holiest of holies, it ain't even the same league, ain't even the same ballpark, it ain't even the same fucking sport. <laughs> Have you ever given a foot massage? Man, don't be telling me about no foot massages. I'm the foot fucking master. Given a lot of them? 
Shit, yeah. I got my technique down. I don't tickle or nothing. Have you ever given a man a foot massage? Fuck you. <laughs> How many? Fuck you. Would you give me a foot massage? I'm kind of tired. Listen, man, you best be backing off. I'm getting pissed. There's the door. And what time is it? 7.22 in the morning. It ain't quite time. Let's hang back. Sure. Look, just because I wouldn't give a man no foot massage doesn't mm -hmm. make it right for Marcellus to throw Antoine off of a building into a glass motherfucking house. Fucking up the way the dude talks. That ain't right, man. Motherfucker do that to me, he better paralyze my ass because I will kill a motherfucker. <laughs> I'm not saying he was right, but you're saying a foot massage don't mean nothing and I'm saying it does. I've given a million ladies a million foot massages and they all meant something to me. We act like they don't, but they do. That's what's so fucking cool about them. This sensual thing going on that's nobody's talking, but you know it and she knows it. Fucking Marxalas knew it. And that Antima should know fucking better. That's his fucking wife, man. He and I gonna have a sense of humor about that shit. And that's an interesting point, but let's get into character. Hmm, what's her name again? Mia Wallace, why are you so interested in Big Man's wife? Well, Maslas is leaving for Florida. And when he's gone, he want me to take care of Mia. Take care of Mia? Mm -mm, not that. Take her out, show her a good time. Not that, like, get her lonely. You're gonna be taking Mia Wallace out on a date? It aren't a date. It's like when you and your buddy's wife go to a movie or something like, uh, uh, it's a good uh, company, you know? Uh, it's not a date. But you're gonna be taking Mia Wallace out on a date. It's not a date. <laughs>